Hello friends, this is Manning Sangvi from vlamon.com and I am back with another video on SQL Server 2014 interview questions. And in this video, we are going to learn the difference between delete and truncate command. So let's start. So interview question for this video is difference between delete and truncate. And if you want to know the complete list of SQL Server 2014 questions with answer then it is available at http www.blog.plemon.com post 2014 at SQL Server interview questions dot php now the main difference between a delete and truncate is first is truncate is a ddl command and delete is a dml command what is ddl and dml uh, ddl means data definition language and dml means data modification data modification language if you want to know more about ddl and dml you can check my blog and if you want exact link i am going to share this inside the description of this video second truncate is faster than delete why truncate is faster than delete because truncate is just deleting everything from your database table and delete is going to log everything in transaction log so if you are going to use truncate for deleting your records you are not able to roll back but in case of delete you can so the third difference is control back in truncate i share you the reason why because delete write everything in transaction log in case of tri uh, truncate triggers are not fired but in case of delete triggers are fired so if you created a trigger on database table on delete actions then triggers are fired in case of delete but in case of truncate no you can't use where clause in truncate you can use where clause in delete why the syntax of truncate is truncate table and table name the syntax of delete is delete delete from table name where column column name and condition so this is optional if you are not going to provide the anything then delete command delete everything from your database table but if you want let's say I have a employee table and I want to delete those employee who is not active in my organization so I can use delete from my employee table where employee status is not active or equals to let's say it's a 0 and flex 0 for not active and 1 for active so you can use where clause in case of delete truncate reset identity okay if you have any identity column in your database table then if you use truncate command your identity is reset but in case of delete it not truncate release use space and delete can't so let's check practical implementation of all of this I created a table TBL employee with three columns ID employee name and salary and inside this I inserted lots of record so let's check count one from table employee so in this table I have 18 lakh 9400 and 49 records mm, let's say some data select star from 
Cable and fly. Let's see. Top and record. And this is the data inside my employer table. How I populated it? I populated it using a loop. So I can demonstrate you the difference between delete and truncate. Now what we have to implement okay let's see truncate is faster than delete so also I created few backups so use our first backup and in this we are going to use delete from table employ backup so execute this query and check the time of execution here execute and time of execution is 3 second, 4 second, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. oh my god I am feeling sleepy let's take a nap it's taking so much of time it's wasting my time what I have to do I have to wait I am not able to do anything so let's check in the meantime let's check how fast is truncated okay our delete is completed in 33 seconds great you are fast my system is fast now we are going to use truncate command so <laughs> truncate table table n so um, why not execute this in some or just take a screenshot so I can share or we can use it for purpose. print screen windows r ms paint please open control v and here is our time so our delete command took 33 seconds and now I am going to use my truncate so any guesses how much time it will take uh, maybe 15 seconds or 20 seconds let's execute oh it completed in only milliseconds I oh wow it's great so this is proved that truncate is faster than delete hence proved I like this term in my school times whenever I proved anything I feel very lucky to write this line hence proved now can't roll back uh, this is out uh, not part of the scope of this video uh, I am going to show this in other another video how to roll back if you delete something now triggers are not fired also I am not going to show this let's see you can't use a clause in truncate okay so as I told you you can use where clause in delete so I have a table name table employee backup under 14 in this I have 11 records so execute and I want to delete this two record or let's say this four record so four five six seven so I can use delete where ID in four comma five comma six comma seven and execute but you are not able to do this with truncate okay here is the error incorrect syntax near where clause so this is also brood you can't use where clause in truncate hence brood now next truncate reset identity okay so let's say this table
contains seven records and I am going to delete everything from this table so what is the syntax yes uh, delete from table name now this is done next I am going to insert a record in this table so insert into so my table contains nothing and now I am going to insert a new record employee name how much already where you will use a new employee new employee and with salary let's say 748 execute now what is the ID for this employee any guesses 12 13 14 15 the answer is 12 now let's truncate this table and again insert truncate this table and again we are going to insert a record in our employee table one row is affected now what is the ID last insert record ID is 12 so most probably it is 13 oh it's 1 why truncate command is going to reset identity now last is truncate release space used how to check we have still two backup tables are available so I am going to again execute this but before executing this sp space used this is a store procedure to check the space of a database table and why not check space for both the table I have to use go I think so I can execute it simultaneously but at a time ok why backup one is contains zero report oh my god so I have to ok my backup one is, I already downgraded my backup one so consider this stable I hope both the contain same records ok yes both the contain same records and we are taking screenshot for our reference if required so my table underscore employee dot underscore backup underscore DIT table contains again 18 length records with size almost this is size ok so I am going to plus select plus 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 ok so my table contains almost divided at one zero two four are you kidding one thirty eight MB okay let's assume my table contains one thirty eight MB it use one thirty eight MB space now I am going to delete data from this table execute again I have to wait for 30 seconds sorry guys I am not able to do anything in this scenario ok this time it takes only 9 seconds no problem now I am going to delete or truncate table this truncate is completed and again we are going to check space so see now truncate 0 rows 0 reserved space 0 kb data 
जीरो पे भी इंडेक्स साइज एंड जीरो अनयूज स्पेस बट इन केस ऑफ डिलीट सम स्पेस स्टिल रिमेनिंग वाई आई डोंट नो बिकॉज लेट्स कंपेयर वट इज द अमाउंट ऑफ डेटा इज अवेलेबल फाइव जीरो जीरो फाइव सिक्स प्लस फोर नाइन 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 थ्री टाइम नाइन टू इट्स फोर एट के बी एंड फिफ्टी सिक्स के बी एग्जीक्यूट दिस एंड इट कंटेंस वन जीरो टू फोर सो ऑलमोस्ट नाइन्टी सेवन ऑफ एम बी डेटा इज स्टिल यूज बाय यूर ब्लैंक टेबल सो दिस इज द बेस्ट ऑफ स्पेस एंड इफ यू आर अ डी बी ए देन यू हैव टू कंट्रोल दिस सीनारियोज सो दैट्स इट फॉर द डिफरेंस बिटवीन डिलीट एंड ट्रंकेट इफ यू लाइक दिस वीडियो डोंट फॉर गुड टू सब्सक्राइब एंड शेयर विथ योर फ्रेंड्स एंड थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग एंड सी यू अगेन इन माई नेक्स्ट वीडियो ऑन सिक्वल सेवन टू थाउजेंड फोर्टीन इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन थैंक यू एंड बाय